Good morning. You are welcome to Flip TV News. My name is Victor Ajayi. First, the headlines. Council poll. Wiki IGP wants to throw rivers into anarchy. APC chief Oji Tinubu. Now the news in full. Else, while National Publicity Secretary of the defunct New People's Democratic Party and chieftain of the All Progressive Congress, Chief Eze Chukwemeka, has urged President Bola Tinubu to call IGP Egberto Kun and FCT Minister Inyesan Wiki to order. Overburying tension, particularly created by the police in their unprofessional handling of issues pertaining to the scheduled October 5 local government elections in River State. As they said, the call became necessary given the series of biased indulgence of the police to frustrate the LGO poll, particularly the unlawful invasion of our River State Independent and Neutral Commission Office in Port Court at 1 a.m. this morning by marched, by marched men in police uniform who had mocked the facility to cut away sensitive materials intended for use of the, for the election. Sadly, the so-called policemen were mobilized from neighboring states in order to cause chaos in the state. In a statement on Friday, Chief Eze warned police officers to be wary of being deceived into a situation in which they find themselves as partisan agents of wrongdoers in the pursuit of their selfish private vendettas, stressing that if there exists a cause order bearing them, barring them from participating in the election, they should simply comply and steer clear rather than interfering to sabotage the process of service the ego of the FCT minister. As a berated the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory in Yuzumwiki over his repetitious machinations in collaboration with the police to frustrate the reverse local government election, describing it as a show of shame. The reverse state independence electoral commission has had fixed the council ele election following a presidential directive to governors to ensure democratically elected council administration in the 774 local government areas in line with the recent Supreme Court judgment which frowned as the use of caretaker committees to run council administrations contrary to the letters of the constitution. The APS court made several other, several other orders, including the immediate stoppage of statutory allocations to local government councils without democratically elected officials. Unsettled with the development, the camp of the FCT minister launched a series of schemes to frustrate the elections, including a foiled attempt by former council chairman loyal to the FCT minister to perpetuate themselves in office beyond their exit date through an unlawful amendment of the state's local government law by pro wiki former lawmakers, which amendment was unturned by the court. They had also made attempt to shock judgment from some judges who have turned their court into cash and carry centers to stop the election and they mobilized protesters to demonstrate against the planned election in a bill to curry public sympathy. As they said, the failed protest may not be the last resort of the FCT minister and his team as intelligence report reveals a clandestine plot to scuttle the election across the state through court boys who have been mobilized and briefed with assurances of police protection in that regard. The APC chief said, Wiki's desperation is, see, is to see to the failure of Governor Sim Lai Fubara's administration in order to have something to gloat over. All the political parties except PDP are participating in the election. PDP opted out on the orders of Wiki, yet the man who is not interested in local government areas election is doing everything to frustrate the exercise. The non-participation of pro-Wiki PDP in the reverse local government area election is a clear pointer to cowardice. They know there won't be any avenue for manipulation. That is why they opted out and started deploying schemes to sabotage the election. Wiki strives in manipulation is the alleged. Eze urged Tinubu to call the FCT minister and IGP in order to order in order to in order not to throw river state into anarchy. It is the duty of the governor to secure his state, and where police feel the governor is under obligation to live up to his constitutional responsibilities, regardless of the way and how he tends to do so. Why calling on voters to turn out in masses and vote candidates of their choice is the urge them not to use to threats and intimidation from the camp of the FCT minister and his band of stranded politicians. That will be all on our news updates this morning. Join us for more stories and on our channels. Flip TV, Flip TV Plus. My name is Victor Ajayi. Oh,